So Nicole, what do we have here today? So Yaku, we've got a cylinder head here today. Remember, we shot an engine block before and it fared pretty well. I want to know, will the cylinder head do the same? But there's some material differences between a cylinder head and the engine block. Tell us about it, Yaku. Yes, Nicole, there's substantial differences in material used to make the, the components. The engine block that we shot last time is made of cast iron. The cylinder head is made of aluminium. However, if we look at this, you can see that there's substantial amounts of material being used with very thick wall thicknesses. What are you feeling? What will happen? I think it depends on where we actually impact the cylinder head, but I can't wait. Let's find out. Three, two, one. Yaku, after the engine block, it was 1-0 engine block AK-47. Now we've got the cylinder head here, and I believe it's 2-0 engine to AK-47. The cylinder head stopped it. Exactly. So we hit it here just below the valve. There's no damage on this side. Looks like the uh, projectile was stopped inside one of the water jackets. Yes, so do you think if we shot at another place it would have gone through or is it a good chance that it would have stopped? Most likely not. So uh, there's a lot of layers with the water jacket and all the other uh, components inside. And obviously the valves are quite hard. So in my opinion, you're quite safe behind the cylinder head. So when somebody mentioned to you, you will be safe behind the engine block, you can reply and say, I'll also be safe behind a cylinder head but I'll be most safe in an SVI armored vehicle.